Hi guys, so we're back here with our Peppa screen, um, and today I'm going to be showing you um, how to get custom content because in my last Sims video people were curious. So the website I use is thesimsresource.com. Um, it's really only for Alpha CC, and there's a ton of ads. And when I say a ton of ads, there's ads everywhere. Um, so, yeah, just be aware of that. And this is Alpha CC. You can go to The Sims catalog, and there'll be a lot more Maxis match, which is just like stuff that matches what The Sims create. And then Alpha is like more realistic stuff. So, to begin with, we're going to say, um, here, let's go to. Um, like, and this does have a little, like, some Maxis Match stuff, but not a lot. Okay. So, let's search an item. So, you can search. Oh my gosh, what happened? So, this site's very laggy because so many ads. So, you can either type to search something, or you can also go to downloads and then. You go to show all, and then you can do that, and then you can categorize and stuff. Um, but just for now, we're gonna just search something. So, um, maybe I wanted a. Hmm, address. Fall dress or autumn dress. And then it'll show you all the items of fall dresses you can get. Just these are a few. So I think I'm going to get this kid's dress. It's more Max's match, but it doesn't really matter. Um and lots of times some creators um it glitches and yes my computer says that um it glitches and it says that you like you either didn't get it <coughs> and stuff so yeah so once you click on your item you scroll down until you see this download button and there might be other download buttons around it don't click any other download button besides this one and then once you go to download, it'll take you to the um, this um, screen, and it'll tell you how many more seconds until it your item will come. Okay, now my item is here, and it will show it. Then it'll take you to this screen. I'll say thank you for downloading, and if you scroll down, you can, wait, no, you don't scroll down. You can just go back to browse page and go back to things, and then front page is just like this page. Wait, no, it's not in the mind. Okay, um, now it should be right here. You do oh, show in folder, and again, I'm on a Mac, so it might be different for you. And then you see this here. You Then you go to Desktop. Wait, no, Documents. You go to Documents. Then you look up Electronic Arts. And then there should be two files. Um, and you click one of them. You go to The Sims 4 and mods and then it should have all your cc you probably won't have any but i have a lot so then move that to the side then go back to the site and go back to this and show in finder or just folder then I'll take you back to this page then you just take this out drag this in put it in the mods file and you can press X on both of these, and your thing will save. 
then you go to then you get into the game and you can you can only download um things one at a time and yeah so you go to the game and when i first got it um i was we I got it with my friends, um, and it took us about maybe an hour to figure it out. We watched a YouTube video, lots of them, um, except it just we kept failing. And you guys might have the same issue, but you just keep on trying. I promise you, it will work eventually. And once you're loading into The Sims. And you can have custom content even if you're base game, um, which means you don't have any packs. Um, I only have one pack, and it's um, cats and dogs. Okay, so then once you get into the game, um, you should have this file come up. Um, it shouldn't have anything in it unless you already have custom content. Um, and then you just press OK. You go into the game. And it depends how fast your Wi-Fi is for how fast the loading screen's going to go. Currently, my, my internet's not that fast. Okay, this is taking a second. And it will give you, hint, like, not hints, but, like, um, just to nose or stuff. Like, right here, based on what packs you have and stuff. Okay, don't judge this, please. Um, some of my houses don't have rooms because this is glitching. This is not my open gallery. Okay, yeah, we'll just, enough of that. Okay, so then you can you, you click that. Okay, and now that you're in the game, you're gonna have a sim, and your background will probably be blue or something. And so, I got a dress for kids, so I'm gonna make her a kid. Okay, and then you go here, and either you can just look through this to find it, like I found mine right here, or you can go to content, and then custom content, and then I'll show you everything you have for custom content. This is all my one pieces, so you can go like shirts and get shirts. So then it will show the dress you got, then you can change its color and everything. So yeah. That's how you get custom content in The Sims. So, yeah. Thank you so, so, so much for watching this video. Really appreciate it. Um, so, yeah. Bye, guys.